Hello everyone, welcome back. Thank you for joining me for another video. All right, so um, really quickly, I just wanted to say, if you saw my last video where I did the cricket and the dragon and I embellished that piece, um, I really, really loved it. And yes, I just wanted to apologize because I screwed up during the editing process. I don't know what happened and I ended up messing up the music portion of it. The music was only supposed to be played when the part of the video was sped up, like when I was painting the dragon with the little brush. And I screwed all that up. So there was music when I was talking. So this is what happens when my life is super stressful and I just have way too much going on and I'm doing things really quickly and last minute and I just screwed it up. So sorry, you know, shit happens. You know what I'm trying to say. It happens. I'm human. I make mistakes. So, you know, it is what it is. But, uh, you know, at least you could still kind of hear me anyway. Um, next thing, that piece is still available. If anyone is interested in the dragon piece, if you have no idea what I'm talking about, head on over to the previous video. Um, I was using my hair dryer not long ago and it just stopped working on me. And I think I almost had a heart attack and I think it was because I overheated it. And thank God it still works, but it made me really think I should get a backup just in case. <laughs> but I, like I, I almost cried because I really thought I, I, I burnt it out. And so I let it cool off and thank goodness it started working again. Anywho, today I am going to be doing a Valentine's Day themed pour. Now I know it's only February 8th when you're watching this. Um, but I have so much going on. I'm leaving for Charlotte, North Carolina next week. Um, for those of you who are joining us, I cannot wait. Tammy and I cannot wait to see you guys. We still have some spots available. If you are interested in coming to Charlotte, North Carolina to see Tammy Anderson and I, and we are going to be doing classes, live in-person classes for you guys to learn and get hands on. It's going to be at the Hyatt Hotel right by the airport in Charlotte. So that is February 18th and 19th. If you are interested, we do have a few spots left. Our Saturday evening class is fully sold out. Our Saturday morning class, only a few spots left. So um, for information, email us at fluidartescape at gmail.com. And the sale for $50 off your ticket is still going. So you can save $50 off your ticket if you buy one now. <clears throat> so um, that's it. So I'm working on an 18 by 24 inch canvas. I got a few back in stock. I headed on over to Michael's. So 18 by 24. And um, what I didn't do, not that it matters, but anywho, I'll tell you guys my base paints. My base paint is Titanium White by Amsterdam and Oxide Black by Amsterdam. Okay, so those are my base colors. The colors I'm using, as I mentioned, are going to be Valentine's Day themed, or just pink. If you love pink, it's a pink theme. And I've got quite a bit of them. So this is gonna be a little meh. Let's start with Reflex Rose by Amsterdam. Gotta throw in that neon rose. Then we have Pearl Tulip Pink by Arteza. Now, not to be confused with, where'd it go? Here we go. This is pearl tulip pink, and this is pink, pearl pink tulip. So there, it's so crazy. Pearl tulip pink, pearl pink tulip. So this is from the pastel box. There's a pastel metallic, so that's what this one is from. So keep that in mind that there are two different pink tulips, okay? So... If you're looking for it on the Arteza website, don't think I made a mistake and I, I said the wrong thing. So pearl tulip pink from the pastel colors, okay? Um, and then I have uh, pyrrole red deep from the Amsterdam Expert series. Then I'm going to throw in some pearl cream by Arteza. Then a little bit, a little bit of 24 karat gold by Deco Art. 
Then I have Primary Magenta by Windsor and Newton. Oh boy, I'm running out of space here. Then I have Pearl Rose by Arteza and topping it off, Persian Rose by Amsterdam. So that is a lot of colors. I don't recommend you doing that many colors if you are a beginner, <laughs> but we're gonna try it anyway. And of course I'm using the flower hair dryer. So I'm going to put these back in order like so, and I am going to flood my canvas and I'll be right back. everybody canvas is flooded and my lines are going really wonky right now on me um that usually doesn't happen so it just goes to tell me that there may be um um you know part of the canvas might be sagging somewhere or it's just i don't know so i'm gonna get going before it really starts to get too wonky on me and because look at this is so wonky it's never like this you know sometimes you're just not meant to be painting one day and i think today is that day um i just feel like it's not my day to paint um but you know what they say the show must go on and the paintings must be done and the videos must be uploaded you know so i just sometimes I don't know. I'm I'm hope I'm not jinxing myself here, but I just feel like I've had, you know, a few issues this morning already. And I'm just kind of worried that maybe it's not my painting day. Look, and now I'm making a mess on the table. Oh goodness. Maybe I just, you know, there's a lot going on. I'm like super stressed out. There's just anywho. Valentine's Day is coming up and we're already almost, almost, not quite, but almost into mid-February. And that's it. I really don't have much to say today. Sorry, just feeling a little off today. All right, a little bit of the 24 karat gold. Okay, now we've got the primary... Actually, it's not primary. I keep saying that because that's what the sticker on, my, on the bottle says, but it's wrong. It's actually permanent magenta. It's permanent magenta by Windsor and Newton. So yeah, I keep messing that up. I keep trying to remember to change the label on the bottle and I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting. That's okay. All right, last color, Persian rose. There's a lot of paint on here. A lot of paint on here and I think I went a little too heavy on the neon pink here but we're about to find out in a second how this is gonna turn out all right let's blow her out let's see what we get
Okay, let me tell you my observation on this painting. So because my lines, my black and white lines were so wonky, look what happened. I ended up getting black into this petal here. I'm not actually not hating it, um, especially with the neon pink bordering it, but that typically doesn't happen for me when I'm blowing this out but the black definitely got caught into the blowout and ended up on this side when it should have just stayed on this side. So there's my one issue, which isn't horrible, but it usually doesn't happen. I actually really like this. Here, I'm not so crazy about. Um, I love, love this red streak here in the black. I think it looks fantastic. I love... Like, I love all of this, all here, 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 here. And then here's kind of where I get a little up, you know, not upset, but not happy. Um, I keep digging, dipping my fingers into paint here. So let me start by fixing this straight edge here. And just kind of give it a pedal. So that's good there. Um, I'm not sure. I'm really hoping this doesn't touch, but I don't want to fidget with this because I love the way this looks. Um, I don't know. I don't think there's much I can do at this point. Um... I don't want to really fidget with it. And you know what? I don't know how this is going to dry because there was something off with the canvas to begin with. You know, sometimes you get duds at Michael's, um, you know, and it's hard to tell when you buy them. Like I try and make sure they're not um, warped, but sometimes, and I did spray it. I did spray the back of my canvas with water. So, you know, I'm not really sure Maybe the canvas just wasn't good. But anywho, um, that's all I'm going to do with this. I'm actually not going to touch anything else. So I'm going to fix up my edges and I will bring you in for a close-up. Be right back. All right, everybody. So before I show you guys the close-up, don't forget to take your stick. First of all, cover that white spot there. Okay. Take your stick and scrape those drips. Okay. Okay. Scrape the drips all the way around, all four sides. Come back 10 minutes later to it because there's going to be new drips. And then do it again and then a third time. All right, so here it is. And you know what? The more I look at it, the more I'm loving it. I just wish some of the black hadn't have got caught, like right here on the right-hand side in that petal. Um, I just wish some of the black wouldn't have gotten mixed up. On the white side of the portion you know of the blade of the base but it is what it is I knew something was gonna happen I knew it was gonna be funky but look at this red strip I wish there was a little bit more red in here um, but you can see red and some of that magenta along the tips here this I really really love this part of the painting I really 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 love it's just the part on the left hand side that's a little bugging me all right let's see what kind of shimmer we have let's start up here at the top now i know there's going to be shimmer because there's obviously the 24 karat gold then i have the pearl but then there's also two of the arteza oh my camera's changing color on me as usual so there's four shimmery colors in this painting so there's definitely going to be a lot of shimmer to this once it dries oh wow look at the gold within the red oh it's so pretty I really like that oh too close too close but yeah you get the idea there's definitely going to be a lot of shimmer in here And there you have it, everyone. Um, you know, I kind of look at it and I think, I don't even think Valentine's anymore. I think like rich, bold, mysterious kind of pink pour. 
I don't know, like it's deep. I, I don't know the right word for it. Maybe you guys know. Let me know in the comments below. But let me know either way in the comments below what you guys think of this piece. Um, did the black ruin it a little bit? Do you think it's fine? What do you guys think? Let me know. Um, again, don't forget, if you want to come see Tammy and I, you got one week left. Oh my gosh, one week left and that's it. Check out the description below my video for discounts and links and all kinds of information, the names of all the colors I used and all of that fun stuff. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Happy early Valentine's. Um, but yeah, that's it for me for now. Until next time, my friends, thank you so much for watching. Have a good day, have a good night, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye.